हेलो एवरीवन टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन अबाउट नॉर्मल फॉर्म्स डिसजेंटिव एंड कंजेंटिव नॉर्मल फॉर्म्स द डेफिनेशन इंट्रोडक्शन पार्ट आई विल एक्सप्लेन एंड आफ्टर दैट वी विल डू फ्यू प्रॉब्लम्स डिसजेंटिव नॉर्मल फॉर्म कंजेंटिव नॉर्मल फॉर्म द डेफिनेशन आफ्टर दैट हाउ टू फाइंड पी डी एन एफ पी सी एन एफ ऑल्सो वी विल लर्न द डेफिन इंट्रोडक्शन पार्ट वी विल सी नाउ नॉर्मल फॉर्म डिसजेंटिव एंड कंजेंटिव नॉर्मल फॉर्म्स and now a product of variables a product of variables and their negations are called elementary product see for example elementary product is a product of variables and their negations that means p negation p p and negation p negation p and q p and negation q like that such type of uh, products having the products are having elementary products are having only and symbol uh, and symbol uh, this is the uh, conjunction symbol now in the same way a sum of variables a sum of variables and their negations are called elementary sum sum of variables and their negations are called elementary sum for example elementary sum is equal to in the same way q negation p p r q p r negation q negation p r negation q like that a uh, variables the sum of variables and their some variables and their negations are called sum of variables and their negations are called elementary sum now like this the examples of elementary product having and symbol and a sum is having only r symbol now a compound proposition a compound proposition which consists of a sum of elementary products a compound proposition which consists of a sum of elementary products and which is equivalent to the given proposition is called disjunctive normal form it is having sum of sum of elementary products sum of element sum of elementary products and which is equivalent to the proposition is called disjunctive dnf disjunctive normal form in the same way a formula which consist of a product of elementary sums product of elementary sums which is equivalent to its proposition is called p and uh, we call conjunctive normal form cnf uh, like this pnf definition uh, cnf conjunctive normal form definition now we will find how to find what is the definition of pdnf as well as pcnf now principal disjunctive normal form principal conjunctive normal form what is the definition and finally we will learn how to find all these things now given a number of variables the products in which each variable or in and its or its negation but not both uh, the products having only products in which in in these products in which each variable or its negation each variable or its negation but not both occurs only once each variable or its negation variable that variable or its negation but not both occurs only once are called min terms what is mean by min term one variable if p occurs means negation p do not occur if q is there negation q do not occur like that either variables in the in the products in that products what we have to uh, see which the variable or its negation but not both occurs only once are called min term and in the same way we will see the another definition max term what is max term in the given number of variables the sums in the sums in the sums in which each variable or its negation but not both occurs only once only once is called max terms now the above one is min term is we have to see the products having and symbol now here we have to see the sums means r symbol in the sum the sums in which each variable or its negation but not both occurs only once is called max terms 
Now the formula of PDNF. What is the formula of PDNF? Sum of min terms. Sum of min terms whose truth value is T is called PDNF. The formula of PDNF is the sum of min terms whose truth value is T. In the same way PCNF is uh, the sum of uh, the uh, sum sum of <coughs> PCNF formula is sum of min terms whose sum of min terms dash sum of min terms dash whose truth value is F sum of min terms dash whose truth value is F these two are the formulas to do the problems.